Hi, my name is Jay Robbins. I'm the broker at Robbins Real Estate Group, and this is video number four in a series explaining the Texas one to four family residential contract. So paragraph 6A, most people only pay attention to one thing, and that is who pays for title insurance. So let's go over that first, and then I'll tell you a little bit about what title insurance actually does for you. Now, title insurance on a moderately priced home costs about one half of 1% of the sales price. At least that's today's rates in 2020. By the way, it is a promulgated number. You can't shop at different title insurance companies to get different rates. It's not like auto insurance. It is a set rate. So typically the seller pays for it almost all of the time. The only time we really see buyers paying for title insurance is when there are multiple offers and the buyer really wants to sweeten the pot and make a great offer and take that expense away from the seller. Sometimes investment properties, you see the buyer offering to pay title insurance because they're buying from a seller that's in a distressed situation, something like that. The other time we see title insurance being paid for by the buyer is in build contracts, new construction sometimes. But in these one to four residential contracts for pre-owned homes, it's almost always the seller. Now, the question is, what does title insurance even do for you? So title insurance makes sure, it's, a, it's an insurance policy on the title of the house. So let me just give you a couple of examples. This will probably help you understand it better. Let's say a buyer buys a house and six months later, a roofer comes knocking on the door and says, are you the owner here? Yes, I am. Well, I put a roof on this house a year and a half ago and I never got paid. I need to get paid or I'm gonna put a lien on the property. Well, as the owner of the house, actually he has the, he has the right as a contractor to put a lien on the property, but if you have a good realtor who helped you get a title insurance policy, you can just call your title company and they will help you get that taken care of. That's the kind of thing that title insurance covers and that's why it's really important that you have a realtor that understands this and that makes sure you get title insurance as a buyer. As a seller, you definitely want to provide title insurance to a buyer. Number one, it's usually required by the lender. But number two, there may be liens on the property as a seller that you don't even know about. So you want to make sure that that buyer feels comfortable, they have good title, and you want to minimize your liability for unknown liens. Now it's important to note, and nobody really pays attention to this, and there's not a whole lot you can do about it, but there are exceptions to what is covered in title insurance. That's covered right there in the paragraph 6A title insurance. Okay, I hope that cleared up a couple of things. In our next video, we're gonna talk about the survey. Pretty interesting stuff, lots of moving parts, lots of options on the survey. See you in just a minute.